let's simplify the fraction 4 thirds. So to do that, what we want to do, we want to find another fraction that's equivalent. It's equal to 4 over 3, just that we've reduced it down to its simplest terms. So when we look at 4 and 3, we want to find a common factor, something that goes into 4 and 3. But the only number that goes into both 4 and 3 is 1. So divide 4 by 1, you get 4. Divide 3 by 1, you get 3, 4 thirds. So it's the same thing we started with. Therefore, 4 over 3, the fraction 4 thirds, it's already simplified. It's in lowest terms. We could change it to a mixed number. Right now, it's an improper fraction because the numerator is larger than the denominator. To do that, we divide 3 into 4. So 3 goes into 4 one time with 1 left over, and then we just bring the denominator across. So 1 and 1 third, that's the mixed number for the improper fraction 4 thirds. But in answer to our original question, the fraction 4 thirds is already in lowest terms. We can't simplify this any further. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.